All right, so this UFC Grand Prix tournament is coming up next. This format has been all the rage with a lot of the hardcore mix. Oh! Oh, huge leg kick to that lead leg. Nice head kick. Oh, and he's down. Nice. Switching stances here. Doing a real nice job with these leg kicks, trying to slow his opponent. Oh! Look at this! Who saw that coming? He's got him hurt here. This is crazy! Oh! Nasty combinations here. Big, Big body shot! Body. Oh, he tagged him. He tagged him with the right hand. Nice leg kick. He's keeping his head protected here. Excellent blocking. Looking to avoid that left hand. Oh, you gotta like that leg kick, Joe. Whoa! He's up! Back to his feet again. Amazing. Big oh, left Joe, that is a huge left hand. Back to his feet again. Amazing. Another knockdown! Big huge shot with the left. Oh, he's going for it here. Oh, there's that back with heavy leg kick. Oh. That'll do it! That's it. That's it. The fight's over. That's it. That's it. He kept attacking with those leg kicks over and over again, like we talked about several times throughout the fight. We knew it was eventually going to be a real problem, and this is the last one that he absorbed for the knockout. Yeah, Joe, how's that for a flurry to end this fight here tonight? It was the one big strike that was the beginning of the end, got the knockdown, and then created the opening that allowed him to jump in and ultimately force the stoppage victory. So the referee made the right call stepping in and preventing him from absorbing any further damage. Bruce Buffer has your decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Rodriguez going to stop in this contest at one minute, 34 seconds of the very first round. To play the winner by TKO Assassin. So there he is, the man of the moment after the TKO victory here tonight. He had some doubters coming in here. A lot of people.